Hello, hello, hello everyone. Um, I'm back and today we're not doing a vlog, we're doing something different. I worked all morning so I figured let's do something fun and new, kind of. So I am deciding to do a get to know me um, makeup routine, basically. <laughs> I think it's gonna be a lot of fun because I realize that not many people really probably know me. So it's probably good to just like, you know, get to know each other. Let's get started. I just want to be known that I haven't done my makeup in about three months. I have not worn any makeup besides like mascara and like my eyebrows in forever. I, for I don't know why, I just haven't done it. I think I've just been too lazy if I'm being completely honest. Are we surprised? No. Yep, so you're gonna see me go from a zero to a 10 in this. Hopefully, hopefully. So, first question to find out. Where was I born? Where do I live now? Where did I grow up? So, um, as a kid, I like, I moved around a lot, like a lot, a lot. Um, I'm originally from West Palm Beach, Florida. Grew up there, lived there until I was about like eight years old-ish, like around that area. So like that's where I, like, I really say that I like, I was born, that's where like, I grew up. Then my parents got married and we moved to Melbourne, Melbourne, Florida, which is like two hours, I want to say, north of that on the east coast of Florida. Um, it's a tiny, tiny, tiny little beach town. Well, it's like getting a little bit bigger now, but like, it's cute. It's okay. Needless to say, it was really, really boring. <laughs> Not really much to do there, if I'm being honest. Just like the beach. Andretti's, but like who actually goes to Andretti's after you turn 10, so it's like... Um, so, oh, disclaimer, I'm trying out this Makeup Forever Ultra HD foundation that I got in my Ipsy. Let's find out if I should drop that much money on this, because it's that good. So, hopefully it is. Um, so I lived in Melbourne until I graduated high school, and then I moved to Tampa, where I go to school now. I'm a third year student at USF, and I'm an advertising and business major. That's pretty exciting. right next to me she's oh, I like watching <laughs> she's just keeping me company because she's a great friend comment below if Gabby's beautiful she is <laughs> the age I normally get mistaken for that's actually a funny question um so since I started working at my new job um I work at a coffee shop I meet a lot of different people and like all of my coworkers seem to think that I was a little bit older than I actually am which is pretty exciting, also pretty like awful because you know like I don't want to look like I'm old. So that kind of sucks. But I think people like, I think the standard age I get mistaken for most of the time is like, I don't know, probably like 21, 22. I'm only 20 right now. Granted, I'm literally turning 21 in like a month. I think foundation is done for the most part. Um, what do I want to be when I get older? <laughs> That's a great question. And the question that I've been getting asked every time I go see my family. Ever since, like, I'm, I'm graduating soon, like in about two semesters, I think. So, of course, now when I go home all the time, my family's like, oh, so like, what are you doing after college? Oh, so like, why, like, what, like, where are you going? Like, what's going, like, what are you doing? And I'm like, I don't know yet, okay? I have a vague idea of what I wanna do. I would like to go into an advertising agency and work as either an account executive or like a production person. I don't really know, honestly. I haven't figured it out. So we're just, we're gonna move on now. Um, my favorite food. Oh my gosh, that's a lot. Those burritos. No. Gabby. Yeah, okay, like they're like my favorite snack. Like I don't wanna call that like a meal. Okay, Chipotle. Yeah, Chipotle, oh my God. <laughs> Burrito bowl from Chipotle. Hands down, best thing ever. Sour cream on the side, extra of the hot sauce. No, not the normal Chipotle Tabasco sauce. It's like the Chipotle, like the Chipotle one. The Chipotle like the, Tabasco. The Chipotle it Tabasco says Chipotle sauce. On it. It's, it's, it's like honestly the best thing ever it's created. It's like a smoky flavor, kind of like barbecue sauce a little. It makes the entire bowl. Cassie turned me on to it when we first met. Yeah. Best thing ever. Oh. Changes, the, changes the game, honestly. Can't forget to bake, ladies. Um. I don't know why I 
said that that's kind of awkward. Yeah, Chipotle is definitely my favorite food ever. Best, 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 best. Um, my pet peeves. Um, there are a lot, I'm not gonna lie. Um, <coughs> keep that in there. Wow, that's cute. Um, I really hate bad drivers, and there's a lot of them in Florida. So that's like the most annoying thing ever. Like Florida probably has like the worst drivers on earth. I know I don't do this right. I know I'm not a makeup person. I haven't done this in forever. And this is just what I do. I don't feel like really baking. It's not that deep. Also, note that it's like nine o'clock at night. And Can we not? Like, I'm gonna do my makeup. Ah. <laughs> Look, when I got home from work today, I literally passed out on the couch. So. Whatever. This is how it is sometimes. So Vlogmas will continue. Vlogmas always continues. Any weird slash hidden talents I have? <laughs> Top five things I couldn't live without. Cassie. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, like I'm gonna be basic, be like my oh, my phone. But it's true. I literally couldn't live without my phone. My entire life is on there. Um, I don't care. That's how it is. My laptop. My Bible. My mom. Her. My friends. I'm gonna put you guys in one giant group because, like, honestly, couldn't do this without you guys. Um, if you guys know what I'm doing, I'm like putting bronzer on. Uh, yeah. So those are the five things I definitely could not live without. Don't know what I'd do. Probably wouldn't survive. For being honest. Favorite bands and musicians. Oh, so that's perfect. Um, since the 2018 um, Spotify year wraps, just like finished. Um, I got to know like what I listened to the most this year and like some things made sense and other things I was kind of like I don't remember listening to that that much, but I guess like Spotify, I guess it's right. I don't know Um, but I listened my number one artist was John Mayer <laughs> I listened to him for 13 hours. I think that's so funny. I love John Mayer. He's easily one of my favorite artists ever He's like just such good music really good music um I really love Ariana Grande a lot. Um, she's the best. Beyonce is everything. Period. There's no need to explain. Explain. There's no need to explain that. 1975. Young the Giant. Paramore. The last text message I sent and who I sent it to. Um, I texted hello with three question marks to my group chat called support group with my friends Lo, Joy, and Dulcie. Um, I'm not gonna even put any context, that's all I said. Birthday, January 29th, 1998. I am turning. Okay, my mess. I'm turning 21, which is really exciting. Big birthday. Um, I'm not doing anything though. I'm like gonna, I'm probably gonna have like a wine night in and we're gonna paint. Eyes and eyebrows, let's do this. Oh, I didn't finish my question about somewhere I'd like to visit. Um, I would really like to go to Europe more. I said before casting, I visited there. We studied abroad for like a month, I wanna say. So that was like, honestly, so much fun. So my camera turned off. <laughs> so we're gonna- 30, 30 minutes. Yeah, I guess it turns off after 30 minutes, I don't know. Um, I'm putting on like a lash like primer, I guess. It makes my lashes look longer, so it's good. Um, biggest fear. I'm really scared of spiders. I think they're like the worst things ever. I have like severe arachnophobia. Um, I remember one time I was at my friend's house and a, we were in the kitchen and we were just cooking, like living life, like being normal, you know? And then literally the biggest tarantula came out from under one of the couches and scurried up to the other couch. When I tell you I ran so fast, I was crying. I started crying and like vehemently like, like, uh, what's that, what is that word? Um, like, I was like breathing like really, really hard and I like, I literally couldn't contain myself. I thought I was gonna have like a full blown panic attack. It was the worst night of my whole life. Oh my God.
Oh my god. <laughs> I hate my life. Okay. Um, favorite animal. I really love giraffes. I think they're the cutest animals on earth. Um, yeah, they're just adorable. Love them. Wish I could pet one one day. So my camera started freaking out for some reason, don't know why, so sorry if like I'm in like different spots every time. We're trying to get this as like similar as possible, I don't know. Yeah, let's keep going. I'm almost done. I need to hurry up. I've been doing this for way too long. Um, okay, so next question is one food I hate. I really hate, um, I hate Brussels sprouts. There's like one thing that I hate a lot. Oh, you don't like sausage. Oh, I, I hate sausage. Oh my god. So I think weird. it's so gross. This. Do I get grossed out easily? Uh, I guess you do. It depends, I feel like. I think for the most part, yes. I don't really like anything bloody. Or anything like that. I'm. I hate scary things. I'm just like. I'm really bad at it. Never been good. Went to Hall Scream once. Hated every second of it. I don't like being scared. I don't get people that do. Can't watch any scary movies. Only scary movie I've ever watched has been Get Out and the Scream movies. Besides that, I'm a little baby. It's fine. I can't care. Honestly. Look at my clown. Oh, and I saw it. It was such a good movie, though. That was like more of like a cinematic masterpiece, if I'm being honest. <sighs> and I like Stranger Things a lot. Stranger Things is such a good movie. Or TV show, I guess. It's like a TV show ever. Um, oh, yeah, favorite TV show is probably a good question to ask. Um, I, like, like I said, just said, I really love Stranger Things. Um, I really love uh, The Flash and Arrow. I thought I would hate those TV shows forever. Then um, my friend came over for like a week and I just binge watched them with him and they're like the best ever. Guys, I'm finally done. <laughs> That's crazy. It took me long enough. Oh my goodness. Ooh, this looks like really good. I want to just like thank this lighting. Thank you so much, Nikki. You're the best for buying me this for Christmas. Love you, babe. Yeah, this looks so much better than like it ever does. I think honestly it's because of the lighting. Um, also I highly recommend the Makeup Forever Foundation. It's it's really nice. It went on so evenly. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching. I had so much fun filming this video. I can't wait to do another one like this. If you guys want more like this, let me know. Like maybe it could like, I don't know, follow a James Charles tutorial something. Well, we can like play around with things. You never know. Um, I will see you guys tomorrow. Thank you so much. Bye. That didn't work. <laughs> hello guys. Or should I say hello, hello, hello. That's becoming my brand. I think I like mm -hmm. it. It's kind of it cute. Um, so that was today's video. I didn't want to vlog today because I was literally at work for most of it, but I thought this was a lot of fun, you know, like break it up instead of like having it constantly be what I'm doing in a day. Um, yeah, so tomorrow's gonna be fun. Back to the vlog. Or actually, no, tomorrow's not a vlog. Yeah, it is. No, it's oh, not a vlog. It's not a vlog. Ooh. It's a secret. You guys That's have to see of, tomorrow. It's vlog style. It's fun. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Um, but yeah, so if you guys like this, please comment, like, subscribe, and share. I would really love it. It supports my channel so much, you know? Awesome. Thank you guys so much. I'll see you guys tomorrow.